Hello, everyone. Welcome to the Welpdom, where magic happens. We're happy that you came here. We are uh, going to respond or re respond. <laughs> it's the 19, it's the what? 1870s. We shall respond to a dance for you by Beyonce. Ryan, I don't know anything about the song, except for that it's on album four, which we reacted to, which is in the chronological order. And we're it, going that order because our guide told us to. No, no, stop to saying that. Would you stop saying that? No, album four was not from our guide. You and I are just doing the whole album. We're doing every single album from album four onwards. We're doing the whole album. And then after interspersed with those album, full album reactions, song by song, we're going to be doing some live performances around that time that Beyonce did. Then we're doing the concerts as well. We are doing the journey, Nathan. We're going full throttle. I love our guide, but our guide has nothing to do with the studio album as well. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> Sorry. Nathan, I just want to say that this is from, uh, as Trump would say, China. <laughs> they said that you guys are great. Thank you. China. Or maybe it's China. I don't know. Uh, yeah. I, I so think it's China. <laughs> is it China? No. <laughs> Wait. What? what? It's not China. No, oh, China. Is China. Oh, sorry. That's what I said. That's what I said. China. But it China. Be... Yeah. Yeah. It's yeah. It's Vachina. Okay, Nathan. So do you have? <laughs> sorry. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. If you stick around to the end of this reaction. I'll show you a snippet of a song I made called Dance With Me. Which okay, is so you made a like... song called D Dance With Me because there's the word dance in it? Yeah, this, okay. Well, actually, yeah, yeah, we'll do a poll. Nathan, you play your song after Dance For You by Beyonce. We'll see which one was better, okay? <laughs> Shall we? I will be the judge of that. We'll let our patrons okay. judge as well. We'll let our patrons judge as well. <laughs> okay. Okay, here's some background, Nathan. You ready? Beyonce in the song Nathan is the female protagonist and she expresses her love and appreciation for her man. Hmm. She sings about all the things she will do to show him how much she values him, including dancing for him. Well, that's nice. Hmm. The song is a mid tempo R&B track featuring sensual vocals from Beyonce over echoing drum patterns and clapping synthesizers. Okay. Critics praised his production and Beyonce's vocals, noting similarities to Janet Jackson. Interesting. Oh, interesting. Okay. This song made a little bit more noise on the charts compared to some of the other songs we just did. This song was never released as a single, yet Dance For You charted in several countries based on radio play. It was uh, 78 on Billboard 100 and 6 on the hot R&B songs in the US. The song's music video, which we're going to watch, was directed by Beyonce and Ellen Ferguson and it debuted in November 2011. It's inspired by 1940s film noir. This video was included on the concert DVD Live at Roseland Elements 4, I bought the DVD. So Nathan and I are going to react to her concert. So join our Patreon for that because we don't know if it's going to go on YouTube. That's the honest truth. We don't know if this is going to be blocked on YouTube or not. So stand by for that. Dance for You was part of the set list for Beyonce's Revel Presents, Beyonce Live Residency in 2012, and the Miss Carter Show World Tour in 2013. The song was certified two times multi-platinum in 2022. Well, there you go. Oh. Ready? This sounds like a pretty popular song. It right. sounds like a popular song. This is one of her more seductive videos. Oh. And Elizabeth says, I need to get the fly swatter. Well, the fly swatter has been on standby the whole time. <laughs> it's not the only thing that's on standby. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> it's always ready to go on alert. Ugh, okay. <laughs> gross. <laughs> oh, cool. I see. Well, hello, Miss Beyonce. Come on in. Mm. She loves the blonde hair look, doesn't she? Mm -hmm. There's a lot of blonde hair. Well, hello, sweetheart. How you doing? Hello. Yeah, yeah. Put your jacket over here. Hang it up. Whoa. Oh, okay. All right. I just wanna show you how much 
much I appreciate you yes. Wanna show you how much I'm dedicated to you yes. Wanna show you how much I will forever be true Wanna show you how much you got your girl feeling good Wanna show you how much, how much you understood Wanna show you how much I value what you say Not only are you loyal you're patient with me, babe Wanna show you how much I really care about your heart Wanna show you how much I hate being apart Show you, show you, show you Till you're through with me I wanna keep it how it is So you can never say how it used to be About it day and night. I wanna make that body rock. Sit back and watch. I'm gonna dance with you. Guys, like, I'm oh, sorry, Beyonce. I'm, I'm gay. Yeah, I'm gay. <laughs> that's probably that's why I didn't jump your bones the whole time. But I, just, I did like this part here. Uh, it was nice to have the uh, to have this like drying system for the vajayjays. So they had this. Uh... <laughs> Let's get a little bit moist down there. We gotta dry that stuff <laughs> so it'll slip off their stools. You know. <laughs> Safety first, Nathan. Safety first. We don't want anything to happen to Beyonce. I don't want her to slip and fall. 
So safety first. <laughs> is it my turn to go first? Uh, uh, <laughs> you go first. I okay. So this is a situation where, and this is not a slight, where the song itself isn't the greatest song in the world. It's not. This is. It's, when Nathan and I talk about R and B. This is what we kind of were probably referring to. Is this kind of sound? This is a good example. Now I know we've listened to other songs from her that were R and B that we like. So it's not. A, I'm just saying when we naively. So don't add us in the comments. I'm just telling you when we use that term broadly and incorrectly. This sound styling here is kind of where I would say if all of Beyonce's music was this sound we probably would have tapped out. Hmm. You know, just like if every song styling was just like this. But she's not. That's what we loved about her is she has so many different genres and sounds and stylings, and she's very eclectic in that way that she isn't just this. That's just me. So it's a decent enough song, but it's not. It's it doesn't grab me the way some of her other songs have. Like, for example, like I'm using this as obviously like Single Ladies. Now, people might say Single Ladies is an R&B song, but it's a fun song to listen to. I, so I don't know how to also describe it where this one for me, if I just listen just to the audio by myself in the car ride or something like that, I might not be get excited by it. But if you put on, um, if I were a boy, I don't need the, I, like, I don't need the video for that. I actually don't need that. Mm. It, it, to me, it's almost irrelevant. The video is irrelevant. Yeah. The cop thing, blah, blah, blah. I think it's just a great track. Mm. So what I'm getting at, this is an example of flipping this around where the video is, yeah, it's a lot of fun to watch, obviously. And that's okay. This is a fun video, very sensual, very sexual. And the dancing is incredible by Beyonce. So for me, this was a, the song is like the backdrop to Beyonce's amazing dance performance. And this is what she is. She's a performer. So that's what I'm getting at. That's probably maybe why they made a video because the song maybe isn't the strongest song in the world, but the the video is a great dance performance by Beyonce because those moves she's doing, it's actually, I was thinking about when I was watching her move. I, was, I find it incredible that the body can be manipulated that way to be like, it's, it's interesting how the movement she makes is seductive. Like, why is that a thing? If she did the same moves to, I don't know, Neanderthals like a hundred thousand years ago, would they have been like, Ugh. How is this helping us survive? <laughs> yeah, but it's interesting how body language, right? How over time, yeah. I wonder what time this would have been like, oh, she's being seductive. Like, it's interesting how, it's just fascinating to mm. me. I find it, I don't know, I find it fascinating that the movement of the body is telling me like, oh, you're dancing for me in a way that you're telling me with your movements, you want a piece of me. Mm. And the mm. guy is not responding, which is fine that he's that way. But yeah, if you and I were sitting at the desk, I'd be like, tie coming off, shirt coming off. Okay, <laughs> yeah. what are we waiting for? <laughs> when is this anyway. happening? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, wait, wait, yeah, exactly. When's this happening? I enjoyed it thoroughly. I thought it was a great, great video. The music was in that the, the same, same thing. If we were just listening to that one, we probably would have a completely different reaction. But now that we're here, so at the beginning of this video, I said, I have a song. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Nathan, maybe we'll compare the two. Maybe we'll compare the yeah, two. You ready? So do you want to, what's the background? What's the background? When did, when did you make this? What was the impetus? It doesn't for this? matter. No, I want to know. What year? Come on, Nathan. Wait, were Actually, you 12? Wanna, were you 12? It's probably like around 2011. Oh, okay. Ish. Okay. It must have been like, thinking about Beyonce sure at the time yeah who I didn't even know who that is back then yeah. and the song is called dance with me this one goes to Beyonce the song is for Beyonce and I'm she's not gonna dancing play all of it. for you she's dancing for you yeah. but now you're saying Beyonce dance with dance me dance with me yeah okay. dance with me so Beyonce if you're watching we want your reaction to Nathan's song okay here we go <laughs> here it is <laughs> Was that your son in that picture? It was, yeah. Oh, Let us know in the comments. Was his song better or was Beyonce's dance for you better? Yes. Right here. <laughs> Put Beyonce over top of her dancing to that? <laughs> Thank you. 
dance with me. Oh, okay, all right. All right, let's just... All right. I did. Oh. Okay. All right, hey, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. It's a great song. Thanks, everyone, for joining us for this one. Uh, stick around. we got more to come. If you want to request stuff, you can always join our Patreon and then push it to the beginning of the queue. Otherwise, we'll just do whatever we want. Till then, we'll see you in the next one.